Hey guys, Professor Fat Shady from the University of Trials here, uh, playing a bit of uh, Trials Fusion tonight, Xbox One version. Uh, not really sure exactly why I'm filming this, just for a bit of fun. So uh, one of the things, if I've set myself a little objective right now, I want to get a platinum medal on Red Link's Derby. Uh, I've had a few tries at this, I mean I'll have a look at my, my best time at the moment. Should I better put the sound on? There we go. Uh, my record at the moment is, what am I, 1 fault 149. Top 900 odd. I want to try and get rid of that fault and get 147. It's the fastest time. Pit Viper, obviously. I don't know what you think of the little uh, graphics and logos. Just been playing around with that earlier today. So I think it looks kind of cool. So we might leave it and see how it goes. Let's do this. Right, I'm having trouble with a bunch of different areas. And this this track to me is actually like a hard version of Way of the Ninja from uh, Trials Evolution. There's just so many places where you can make a mistake, like that that little stuff up there cost me a bunch of time. That section there is really tricky. It's, and it's, 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 it's more about consistency than anything else, right? This one here, actually, you hit this fast or slow, and just not consistent. These tires move, you know, like this really little parts to this. And it's not particularly hard, it's just long. That's exactly why, I mean, Way of the Ninja was also hard. I like the fact that they've got a hard difficulty, you know, one and a half fish in mean, a long track. Like, it's a good length for a track, but it makes it really challenging. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Is that what I mean? Stuff like that. Sorry, did I say? I didn't say that word, did I? Alrighty. Let's try this again. See? Ruin that start. Now normally I would just restart, but given that I'm on the quest for the Platinum and Zero Fault... Nah, rubbish. Alright. What, you, what you'll start to find is this is really, for me, a much more about consistency than it is anything else. Individually, I can achieve these obstacles pretty easily, but put them all together, give me a minute and a half to complete them, like that. I do like this song though. Actually, something else that I haven't seen too many people notice yet. The music is actually dynamic in this game. As you're playing through it, the music actually changes to suit... Oh, suit your frustration. That would have been funny. Um, no, to, to suit the different... The, you know, um, there's different trigger points they've got throughout the game. And they've actually made the music change and it kind of does transition from one to the other. So, I was with the, uh, the guys in Helsinki, and I can't even remember who it was now, but someone was actually showing me through and sort of challenging me to see if I could determine ah, where the musical shifts were. And yeah, it's, it's kind of cool. I think it, it does add to it. I mean, the whole idea with the musical shift is you want it to be relatively seamless, and I think they do a pretty good job at it. Until someone points it out to you, and then it's really obvious, and you know, starts annoying you because that's all you can think about. But anyway, let's get back to my Platinum run. I've really been having trouble with this track, and I'm, I think it's just the length, just the consistency. I can, you know, one fault, two fault the track, pretty regularly, but there's just so many parts to it. And then, like, what the... What was that? So frustrating. Yeah, I decided to put together these uh, the graphics and stuff that you can see here, just to, just to make, I guess, from a workflow perspective, make the process of me releasing quick, uh, shorter, you know, quicker videos uh, in a much shorter time frame. Uh, I was doing everything in Premiere Pro and, you know, adding Photoshop graphics and rendering out the files, recording audio separately, and, you know, for the proper University of Trial series, that that's part of what I do. Oh, this. Um, but for, for this type of stuff, just a bit of random fun. Yeah, didn't want to go to all that trouble. Don't have time, so this is kind of a good fix. So hopefully I've got all my audio levels right. I've been testing it for a fair bit today. Hopefully it works. I may just have to deal with a bit more of my randomness. Here we go, here we go. So far from the end. Oh gosh, there we go. See, see. What is... What is this? Do I know what this is? 
so confused. <sighs> okay, here we go again. I say I'm a minute of, you know, I'm going to say perfection. That was a minute without a fault, and it's not good enough. to do much. Remember, I did an interview a little while back about that stuff. They're like, go on, you know, play some trials. Let me get some fear footage of you playing trials. And then I got told that I was very boring to watch playing trials. Oh, well, yeah. You know, I'm not one of these guys that are going to be raging and, you know, yelling and screaming. You know, I'm here to get a job done. The job is to get a button done. So, yeah, I don't know how entertaining this will actually be, but hey. Actually, here's another funny thing too. I have actually got zero faults on Inferno 4. So, that'll give you an idea of how hard... How hard this track is. It's not, oh god, I've done the same thing again. Okay. Oh shit, I just realized it's not just zero fault, but also the minute 47 time. Oh, this should be it, this should be it, this should be it. Jinxes himself, jinxes himself. Now, Xbox One version, everyone will know this. Sorry, glitch guy, beat your time. And now we're waiting for the leaderboards to update. <laughs> and anyone that's playing on Xbox One knows this feeling. Here we go. I should just edit this out, but hey. I just dance. I just think this is a little dance break. It does work. Look, it's it's frustrating, but the one thing. There we go. It's gone through. The one thing I really want to say about that is. I, I, I know a lot of the Red Links guys personally. I know that this isn't something that they're going to be particularly happy about, and it's something that I'm sure they're going to be working very hard to get fixed. I've heard a lot of the, a lot of people a bit upset about how uh, that sort of leaderboard synchronization is working. Um, I think it's just something that you know, the game's new. We're just going to have to put up with it for a little bit, but hopefully they'll have it resolved soon. But anyway, I kind of want to stop the video there. I'll upload this one now. Put Platinum metal down, and um, I might make some more of these things. So yeah, let me know what you think. You know, do all that usual YouTube stuff. Subscribe, follow me. I actually put on the right hand side of the video. You can see there. I'm still getting used to this. Uh, yeah, I put all my details. So if you want to follow me, interact with me, do what you got to do. The details are all there. Um, but yeah, man, I'll uh, I'll try and put some more of these videos out. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon.